we can classify solutions by their ability to conduct electricity. Those that conduct electricity are called electrolytes and those that do not conduct electricity are known as non-electrolytes. Today, let us conduct an experiment to differentiate between electrolytes and non-electrolytes. For this, we need beakers filled with distilled water and salt, a spoon, wires, battery eliminator, bulb with holder, carbon electrodes. Connect the carbon electrodes to the battery eliminator and place them in the beaker containing distilled water. Make sure the electrodes are not in direct contact with one another. Now connect the bulb to these electrodes as shown here. Remember the bulb will glow only if the circuit is closed. In this case, the circuit will only be complete if the current from the battery eliminator flows through the water and to the bulb. Now switch this circuit on. You will see that the bulb fails to glow. This means that the distilled water did not conduct electricity. Now switch off the circuit and add some salt to the water in the beaker. Stir till it dissolves completely. Insert the electrodes just like last time and switch on the circuit. We see that this time the bulb glows. The salt solution conducted electricity. So this proves that pure water is a non-electrolyte and the salt solution is an electrolytic solution. Pure water is a covalent compound without any ions and hence it does not conduct electricity. Salt, when dissolved in water, breaks down into individual ions, which makes it a good conductor. Electrical conductivity of liquid depends on the presence of ions in the solution. Why don't you try this experiment at home? Take sugar solution and find out if that is an electrolytic solution or not.